I believe I have had a deep fried Oreo. Um, you can deep fry lots of stuff. And uh, yeah, older you get, the more it hurts. And uh, man, I'm getting up there in years. Old dog can't teach me new tricks. <laughs> Hi, everybody. It's nice to see you. It's been quite a day. I mean, it's oh gosh, to see Bonalicious with the little, um, with the little feathery, flowery chef's hat. Um, man, nice to see you guys. Hello, socks, and hello, cheese sticks, and your deep fried Oreos. Possum Power, hello. Um, Shiny Savali says, "Would you like help getting sub icons? We can make them pigeons or something." I. You know, I am wrapping up work. I'm going to have a, a three-week break. There's going to be a little break from streaming in there somewhere. And I, I'll take any support that I can get in figuring out little intricacies to Twitch and other things. Just because, I, as I mentioned before, I am an old dog. Um, you cannot teach an old dog new tricks. We've, we've tried. We've tried. I mean... We, I fixed the pigeon at least if you if you do here let's let's double check let me put my money my bread where my mouth is um, we're gonna have it say um, what do I have in my oh, what's um, I okay I got it hold on it's hard to write sometimes okay Luke Landvo cashed in some channel bread, and wants me to say I am the pigeon from the kitchen and I ain't kidding although nothing is written. I am the pigeon from the kitchen and I ain't kidding although nothing is written. That's actually the chicken from the kitchen, Prabba the Rapper. We should play that someday. Um, Prabba the Rapper and I'm Jammer Lammy are two of my favorite games. Prabba the Rapper 2... Um, gets a lot of flack but it has some really good songs in it including the ant who's like you want to grow big we gosh we played the crap out of that game in college oh, what do you think about takis um you know i don't i don't think i've had takis before but i do know they are rampant in um in the school community everybody loves takis um i love the thrift store frog hey who doesn't um here's scare favorites that's it was a good song too like <laughs> he's like because i'm the one who brings out the original flavor flavor for my people people see i i can talk the talk and rap the rap and walk the walk like i legit love that game um, <laughs> and for those of you who don't know what Prabba the Rapper, you, you know, if you aren't familiar with Prabba the Rapper 2, just good luck. So this track just has like 30 seconds of silence. All right, now we're going to have a Wii party. So, um, yeah, things were pretty wacky. Um, full work day, all the stuff involved with that did, um party bags for my daughter's birthday tomorrow <laughs> she's five um recorded something um which is how i got the video footage and um i'm doing the stream i still feel really good um have you ever played five nights at freddy's uh and if so who's your favorite character i haven't played it myself but i i admittedly do um do kind of uh partake of markiplier videos from time to time um game theory as well uh it's just a little guilty pleasure just you know after work um pull up some game stuff and yeah um thank you everybody i'll let i'll let her know um yeah, we're, we're doing a big celebration later this month because my mother-in-law is coming to visit. And so we're going to do like a bigger family thing at that point. Tomorrow's going to be like a little a little thing. Um, 
But um, gosh, yeah, it was just a really busy day and um, I recorded something and yeah, uh, I'm in the process of putting together the programming for um, the Christmas specials. Man, there's having a little extra time is going to really just allow us to dig deep in that dumpster and pull out some real golden treasure. Um, and by golden treasure, I mean we're all going to cringe collectively on the internet. We'll cringe so much that um, our loved ones will feel it from wherever they are. Um, <laughs> definitely watching the Ninja Turtles. Um, the Ninja, oh, you, Bernie Mac. Well, I don't know. Um, yeah, we, we might dig that deep. We might dig that deep. I mean, you yourself saw the, the Ninja Turtles, and uh, how did that make you feel, Bernie Mac? We were uh, talking in the Discord, and I was posting um, more Christmas specials. Um, I'm going to switch over to the main stream window. It was terrible, which is awesome. Um, so I'm going to pause the music now, um, and we're going to... Let me see. Hopefully I can do this without breaking everything. This is window capture. So this is um, footage that I recorded from um, earlier today. Um, this is the um, audio coming from my phone. So this is not my microphone. Um, I typically have to, when I do this particular voice, I have to turn my head away from the microphone because there's no way to do it without blowing the whole thing out. Um, so I know it seems kind of weird, but it all works out. Um, no background on this little project thingy. Um, when I first did um, voiceover classes, I met a guy through classes who could do a really good Donald Duck impression. Um, and we kind of stayed connected and he kind of has his own little side hustle project thingy where um, he wants to dub a lot of the Donald Duck comics because um, he can do Huey, Dewey and Louie. He can do Donald. He does a really good job. And so um, I did the Halloween special. I think it was might have been t two years ago, but um, I did the voice of, uh, of the witch and um so there's a comic where the witch celebrates christmas with everybody and um so this should be out like next week i think it's just a, a comic dub but um i decided to record the whole thing on my phone um in case something funny happened and funny dumb stuff happens every time i go in into my nightmare booth um so this should be a funny part, I think. Well, this is where I record right now. I'm a little embarrassed because um, the wires are in disarray. Yes, it is PVC pipe. Um, I basically have a frame in a walk-in closet um, behind the um, the gray blankets is um, is insulation, rock wool insulation. And um, then it's all wrapped up in acoustic blankets, which they're like they're like moving blankets, but they're really heavy and thick and they're really specific for for sound dampening. Um, <laughs> yeah, and, and um, it, it does work pretty good. And yes, I could st <laughs> still do the lines in, in this recording room. <laughs> this is the room where I have. Yeah, just shoot me a message. Um, I'm going to be just treading water and like trying to survive for the next week or so. Um, but after next Friday, uh, well, then, then my mother-in-law is going to be visiting. So after that mother-in-law visit, <laughs> we're going to have time to, to breathe. Um, it shouldn't interrupt the Christmas specials. But anyway, Bernie Mac, Redeem Hydrate. I have um, soda here, but I also have water. I've... I really like this goal because um, it does make me have um, more liquids nearby because I, I just don't want to be here without a liquid for you guys. I got to have got to have liquid for you. Guys. 
Good night, everybody. All right, so let's look at this. Hopefully, it's audible. Um, all right, here we go. Oh, he'll still take things, but at least we've slowed him down a bit. <laughs> but at least we've slowed him down a bit. Oh, well, he'll still. Oh, he'll still take things, but at least we've slowed him. Hold on, let me turn that down a little bit. Hold on. That seems really loud. Down a little bit. Oh, he'll still take things, but at least we've slowed him down a little bit. <laughs> if thou wishest, if thou wishest it, so be it. If thou wishest, wishes, 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 wishes. Okay, so, so stuff like that. Yeah, the levels do peak. Um, there's no way to to avoid it um, entirely, and uh, yeah, that's why it just. But like, there are moments where I'm definitely screaming, um, struggling. Um, thank you. Uh, I I just I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do this thing. Um, let's uh, we'll make a little a little contenty thing out of it and uh yeah so it's and um i don't know i think that um a lot of voice actors get to a point where they like they get a paid gig and then they're just like oh i'm not gonna work for free anymore i'm a paid voice actor i'm not gonna work for free um well there are projects out there there are people who need support um you know some people really need the the gigs because they need the money and i understand that and i'm i'm kind of a unique case it's not like i'm mr millionaire but like my income comes from my day job um i am all about the creative process and uh for me if i can support somebody in making something um and it seems seems cool you know i'm gonna go for it um and i i'm a decent judge of character um you know i'm not gonna not gonna throw myself into something that i don't feel a hundred percent about um and you'll see you'll see that pop up um down the line there are a couple of cuphead animations there are a couple of other things that are just in in the works and so well see you later should be pretty cool all right so i wanted to make a dr diggity dank is raining with a problem par pa dr diggity dank is raining with a party of five party of five on the usa network what up dr diggity dank and friends I hope you all are doing well. I hope you all are doing dank. Um, it's nice to see you guys and gals and just peeps. Um, we're going to finish uh, Day of the Tentacle, and then I think I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> I was going to do like more DOS games, but like I am pretty fried, and yeah, it's uh, it's another day tomorrow. Um, we completed approximately 69 percent of the game um if you guys want to do this the the joke about that number that's fine you know just go ahead and do that in chat i will say today during a therapy session i was doing mad libs with students and um they uh they busted out you know oh bye cupid bye cupid we'll talk to you soon um I can't remember what what I might have said, Bernie Mac, but um, who knows it was, it was positive. Um, okay. Where were we? Okay, we got the food certificate. We got all of this stuff. Uh, Kiwi Lizard, thank you for following. Um, okay, let's go ahead and get started. So, um, gosh, for those of you who didn't tune into the last stream, um... So this is a point-and-click adventure game. It's a sequel to Maniac Mansion. We're not going to talk to the Purple Tentacle anymore. So um, where we last left off, uh, we had Laverne dressed up as a tentacle. Wait, did I tell... 
Oh yeah, the wait. Okay, Bernie Mac. I don't know what I told you. Never mind. That we're he's he's. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. It's okay. I always say things about people that I know. It's always positive though. But um, I don't know. So this cat is making love to the fence. Um, it's it's beautiful, I guess. We're gonna use the squeaky mouse toy with this cat. I mean, Bernie, I'll tell you my Dr. Diggity Dank stories. Okay, hey. Why didn't he go for the mouse? As if he'd rather scratch himself than play with this adorable rodent. He'd rather scratch himself than play with this adorable rodent. Um. Okay, so what we have to do is we have to put um, white out on the fence. Very specifically on the fence. Oh, I guess we can do... Okay, there we go. This ought to be good. We're trying to make a skunk, alright? There we go. Some Pepe Le Pew crap right there. Ew. This tastes so bad. Now we're gonna get the cat. What do we have here? Indeed, this Looks game was inspired like by, rodent. you know, these games were just, I don't know, they're in the same category. It's it's art. It's such a, mm, there's so much to it. All right, so we got that cat now. We're going to go into the former motel. Uh, we're going to go into the kennel where the humans are being kept. Okay, hey, so um, we're going to take this guy on a date. We're gonna give him the dinner certificate. Whoa, dinner for two at Club Tentacle? I can't wait to tell my wife. Oh man, I I remember Club Tentacle. Those were the days. You're free. Free to do what? Free to, to run wild through the woods like humans should. Big deal. I said you're free. Now get off your fat, lazy butts and start enjoying it. Enjoy being hunted for the rest of our lives by that mustached oak tentacle with a big net? Yes, please. If we ran off, he'd be right on our trail. If we stay here, we know we'll be warm and comfortable. Outside, we'd be eating bugs and moss. You'll be eating my fist in a second. <laughs> the woods are filled with wild animals, lions, tigers, and skunks. Oh my. And I hate skunks. It's kind of cool how they give you, they give you clues. Like, some of these things seem kind of ridiculous, but they give you clues. Look, a skunk. <laughs> Come back here, you mangy human. <laughs> you can't do this. This is an escape proof facility. Okay. Who says you can't learn anything from cartoons, eh? Kid? Hey! Hey! It said it too. All right, we're gonna open the grandfather clock. Going in. So. I know it's really random, but if you remember, we had a, um, 
we had put something in the constitution so that there would be a um a vacuum in every basement or something like that i can't remember the specifics so we've got a generator now um it is a hamster wheel generator and um we also have a cable Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on! Ah! How do I do video games? Use extension cord with the outlet. Okay, so that's gonna go to my Chronogen. Um, here's the thing though. This hamster is a jerk. Actually, I forgot about that. There's a booby trap. <laughs> Smashes into the machine. Um, so now that, you know, you it's just amazing. You could get to this point in the game and not have a, uh, a vacuum to suck up the hamster with. <laughs> that poor hamster. Hold on one second. Let me text. I gotta text somebody. Had to do a recording. Sorry, gotta respond to text messages as hard as it may be sometimes. This is now a dusty, warm hamster. Go on the generator. Look at that sucker go. <laughs> he just keeps running and running and running. Okay, so L Laverne is uh, done, basically. I mean, we could get some more dialogue stuff, but all I have to do is plug in that toilet, and when the time is right, we, uh, away we go. So we're going to pick up the extension cord, we're going to pick up the, po to we're going to use that to that. Alright. 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 One done. All right, so now we're back here. We need to, um, and uh, I don't even remember how, I'm pretty sure I read a walkthrough when I was a kid. Um, like how are you supposed to make, how are you supposed to know that washing your car is going to immediately, um, make it rain like yes i get it like like it was just an, you know like oh just when i washed my car it started raining looks like a big storm see this is why i never wash my car how would you know that i don't know how i knew it but hey, ben. yeah oh it's you where are you going? What about your experiment? Even science sometimes gets cold on account of rain, my boy. But how are you ever going to get lightning if you're not going to stand out in a storm? To be frank, which I am, I don't know. The science of electrodynamics, much like your mind apparently, is still in a state of relative infancy. This guy is a Back dick. To the board, I say. What a genius. Oh my gosh, you'll get yours. Okay, now actually, I mean whilst. Hmm, the design's solid, but I need some waterproof material, like cast iron or something. <laughs> cast iron? Okay, so we're gonna go down here. Okay, so we give him the vinegar. Ah, excellent. I need 
that for my super battery. And then we're gonna give him the gold pen. Ah, the final element for my ingenious battery. Stand back, boy. Give me room to work. We're gonna give him room to work. Thank you, everybody, for coming by. It's gonna be fun when we get through this game. Um, wow. He's got a lot of... Wow. Wow. That's me when I'm editing videos. We got it. A miracle of modern science. It will look lovely here on the shelf until I take it with me to Baltimore. Yeah, you're not taking it to Baltimore. We're gonna look at the bulletin board. It's covered with plans and junk. I think there's a... We're gonna take this battery. Mine. Don't look now, but the British are coming, dude. Eh? 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 Yeah. That's supposed to be funny. I'm very busy. Okay, so I got the battery. We're going to go upstairs to Ben Franklin's room. And, uh, well. Oh, wrong room. And we're going to go into Ben Franklin's room. We're going to close the door. I'm very nervous. I'm just kidding. We're gonna give him a lab coat. I got something good for you, mister. Uh, mister. Mr. Brainstorm? Yes, hand it over. Hmm, doesn't this belong to somebody? Yeah, Red Edison. Ah. I'm sorry, but the man has no vision. A lightweight, durable fabric like this going to waste down in his basement. It's a lab coat. When I'm done with it, it will fly. Hmm. And then... Eureka! The all-season Frankelcopter <laughs> Franco ready to make history. <laughs> no, there's no fuse. <laughs> there's no... So what do I like? The last time you're not going to like anything. <laughs> There's no fuse. The whole time? How am I gonna get up that high? Listen, just wait for me to say the word now. Then push the kite into the air, alright? I'm on you, lasagna. Let's hope so. I'm on you, lasagna. We did it! We... we did it! We did it. Handling kind of funny. You got it. Just hang on. <laughs> he is a King so Candy sounding ass. He does have a King hang Candy sounding ass. Now that was interesting. Yeah. Say, can I see that kite for a second? No, I'm taking it back to my lab in Philly right now so I can study the results. Wish me luck. And he just drops it. If I... I never got your name. It's Hoagie, sir. Nice working with you, Hoagie. I promise to name an invention after you someday. Gosh, thanks. Huh. All right. We got a fully charged battery, so I uh, you might have a little one. I don't know. So um, we're going to use the plug. I don't think it'll get much power from that. We're gonna use the battery with the plug, and now number two is all set. Whoa. So. In order to move things along, we need to get uh, Dr. Ed to sign this contract. But I have to convince him... Oh gosh, I just accidentally tabbed out of the game. I have to convince him how to do that, and I can't remember how. So, um, we're going to talk to him. 
Will you please sign this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. Um... Okay, so read it first. I'm busy trying to think of a way to save humanity. Yeah. I don't have time to read. Now leave me alone. Mm, no. Will you please sign this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. But the whole human race is at risk. Of course. That's why I'm busy trying to think of a way to save it. I don't have time to read. Now leave me alone. <sighs> there might be something we're missing, but I, I, I it might just be the contract? third option. I don't sign things I haven't read. I remember... Sign it or I'll oh. get real mad. And do what? Not be my friend anymore? Ha ha ha. Will you please sign this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. Oh, forget it. I'll get rid of Purple Tentacle myself. Oh, yeah? How? <laughs> I'm starting up a petition to ban all tentacles. Wow! Where do I sign? Right here. Got him. Okay, so now what we're going to do, let's go up here. Yeah, I know the, the, the goodbye option is the one that you're supposed to take. We're going to take the signed contract and send it to the past. Um, so this contract is for the game Maniac Mansion. Which, um, let's see if we can look it's at some it. Kind of legal mumbo jumbo. Okay, so we're going to use the stamp on the signed contract. And so now, um, we're going to have a ton of money. Alright, just a ton of money. Because the thing is, they, they never sold the contract for the game. Like, in, in, in the storyline, they never, they never sold it. Um, they never they never signed the contract and mailed it in so we're we're years and years and years in the past I don't, I don't think you can see but it says LucasArts San Ramon California which I think it says San Ramon yes what do you want hi there is this dr. Fred Edison who did you think you called? Dr. Spock? <laughs> Look, I don't have all day. Rest in peace, Leonard Nimoy. This is Farley Crock at LucasArts Games. I just discovered your contract among some very old files, and, well, our lawyers say that we uh, have to pay you $2 million in back royalties. <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh, for the use of your family in the main... Yeah, we're in California. Video. What? This is Farley Crock. No, I heard that, you moron. When do I get my money? Oh, right now. It's been credited to your Swiss bank account. Operator, get me a travel agent. <laughs> this is an emergency. <laughs> I saw some, some pictures online of somebody going on vacation. Um, I was like, man, that, that must be something to go on vacation. <laughs> Um, we're going to use the phone. Couch Potato Shopping Channel, Wanda speaking. Um, uh, I want to buy a diamond. That will be two million dollars. Do you have a major credit card? <laughs> um, I have a numbered Swiss bank account. What's the number, sir? Um, it's 846-427-35327. Very good, sir. I'm sure that's you some kind of throwback to something. Pronto Post light speed delivery immediately. Thank you for calling. There it is. Now that's service. It really is. So, 
<laughs> the Bernard shaped hole is still out there. All right, we're going to take that. Dr. Fred right away. Dr. Fred is like trying to plan a trip somewhere. That should do it. Where did you get this diamond anyway? Uh, it was donated by a group of girl scouts who were in the neighborhood. <laughs> How heartwarming. <laughs> According to my instruments, everything is in readiness. Your friends have activated their units, so it's time to throw the switch. Great. Hoagie. I'm so happy to... Hi. Laverne. Wow. I'm so glad you two made it back okay. I hate to interrupt, but there's no time to lose. Now that you're back, we've got to proceed with the original plan and send you back to yesterday to turn off the slab-o-matic. Huh? Say what? Now hold on a minute, Dr. Fred. They just barely made it back to our time alive, and I think... Ha <laughs> ha. You can't turn off the machine if I get there first. Don't worry, guys. This time I know I can stop him. Uh-oh. I guess we better do something. Let's go. No, wait! You can't all go in the same stall! Spirit. Didn't you see the fly? <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, I can stop him this time. Oh. We're. We're. We're some kind of monster, dudes. Great. Stuck here the rest of my life, listening to Bernard talking and watching Hoagie eat. Mom warned me there'd be days like this. Now, wait just a minute. It's green tentacle. It's green tentacle. What was that green? <laughs> what? I believe he's trying to warn you about me. Oh. We're going to turn off the sludge matic and defeat your evil plan, overgrown worm. You sorry lot are no match for me. But there's three of us. Well, sort of. Nevertheless, I mean to crush you. Yeah? You and what army? Why, this army, of course. <laughs> the little Yikes. torches. You see, I've been busy. These are all versions of myself from the future. I've been bringing them back here using the Chronojohn. Together, we will conquer the world. You tend there. And guard the sludge matic Notice there's ten of them. That's very important. I mean, kind of. No one is to touch the sludge matic I bet it has a little TM symbol, a little trademark. Now, creature, I must decide what excruciating tortures to leave them to me. <laughs> I've been itching for a chance to test out my newly completed diminuator. Uh-oh. Excuse me. Um, us. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. The rest of you come with me. Next stop, the world. I like how the old purple tentacle has a saggy butt. What do we do now? Whoa. It wears off. Sure does. Aha. Run for it. Damn. Damn. <laughs> the battery must not have had time to recharge, but it will.
Okay. Maybe he won't find us. I don't want to be in this room. You who? Where are you, human? Okay, so let's see. That's Aha. oh shoot. Uh -oh. Hey, we got it. You can't do that. Perhaps if I readjust the static phrase dynamo again. I don't think I can open doors as Aha. Uh oh. Take that. Oh. Drat. Okay, I just have to remember where to go. We're too small to use the stairs. Okay, well. We're too small to use the stairs. Okay, we're gonna go down the stairs now. So I think we need to get... Well, let me see, where are we going here? Hmm, this door appears to be are locked. Are you kidding me? Are you brr, brr, brr? Let me see. We are looking for um you go in here. I don't see some Dr. Fred hanging upside down. Okay, so um I know what I need to get. I just need to figure out how to run into a, uh, a certain place. Can I open this door? Aha. Oh, there we go. Uh -oh. Okay, we're good. I got this. Take that. And this. Drat. Okay, so we're gonna go in here because there's a mouse hole we're going in the hole. So now we're in here. So now we just gotta whip, just wait a little bit and get that bowling ball. Uh, 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 ooh, uh, ooh, uh. Okay, bowling ball. You'll never guess what we're gonna do with this bowling ball. You'll never guess. Hey, where'd he go? They're perfectly lined up. <laughs> Great! Now we can turn off the machine and prevent all this tentacle mayhem from ever happening. I'm certainly glad that's over with. Yeah, let's get out of here. Leaving so soon, uh -oh. we haven't had the chance to get to know one another. Your efforts are so tiny. <laughs> Eek! All right. So Run all you like, you insignificant. I know what insect. we have to do. You can't stop me. My other selves are taking over the world as we speak. You're pretty handy with that ray gun. Center of the forehead every time. Would you like a demonstration? No thanks, we can't afford it. It's free of charge, unlike the diminuator. 
just what is it you have against humans anyway? Humans are our oppressors. They made us live in this horrible motel. <laughs> they created us in ungainly forms, so we could not rise against them. Try walking around with your legs tied together and glue on your shoes. You'll see what I mean. <laughs> Sounds like that's all Dr. Fred's fault, really. Hmm. I suppose you're right about that. Mm -hmm. I didn't start out hating all humans, just Dr. Fred. Why don't you zap Fred with the ray gun for a change? Hmm. Perhaps that would be entertaining. I'll say. Surely we can talk this out. Hmm. Talk? Surely. Huh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I forgot it. the little splatter tux. I wish they would make a sequel. Maybe there's a chance they made they made a sequel for. I mean, they made new Monkey Island game. They could do another day day of the tentacle. Okay, little fella, mail this to Siberia. They could still come back from Siberia, maybe. Oh. Our work here is done. Now we can go home. Apple goo. Apilogu. Well, kiddies. Apilogu. Now kindly get your freakish hide out of my home. Please, Dr. Fred, you've got to get us out of this mess. We look terrible. And we can't buy clothes off the rack. <laughs> I'm getting sort of used to it. Maybe we could go on the talk show circuit. Help us, Dr. Edison. You're our only hope. Another Star Wars reference. Oh, right. LucasArts. Hmm. LucasArts loves a good Star Wars reference. Yeah, they're just all in, in the same. <laughs> so Laverne was carrying all that weight. I'm glad that's taken care of. Looks like everything's back to normal. All right. What a wonderful game. I really, really like this game a whole lot. Um... You know, these, these point-and-click adventure games, um, I spent hours and hours and hours just, like, getting to my favorite parts, or just, you know, I just want to watch certain scenes. Um, in the older games, like, I would just want to repeat things over and over again, and also get into those very specific situations, like, where you get, uh... You get stuck, you know, get all my characters killed or whatever. Um, <laughs> yeah. Um, so, uh, that was a really good game. I quite enjoy that. It's always fun to revisit. Um, we will probably do more LucasArts games in the future. Um, the only thing I just, I have to, I don't know, have to, have to figure out, uh, 
what I'm gonna do exactly. You know, because it's uh, it's a little bit harder to engage with everybody when you know all the dialogue is being read and and stuff like that. So we'll figure it out. Um, we could still probably do Loom at some point, but I'm still kind of toying around with the project there. So we will be back on Friday. We we should, wait. We have to we have to go until at least nine o'clock. We can go nine more minutes, can't we? Um. Yeah, we can go nine more minutes. We got nine more minutes. Um. Then we can then we can say it's a full hour stream. Even though all of this talk about hoagies and whatnot has got me um, kind of hungry. Uh, <laughs> Dr. Diggity Ding will get will request a refund if I don't go for nine more minutes. So um, we will yeah, we will we will make sure to go nine more minutes. I can do nine minutes. Like that's that's um yeah. I mean I, I've done improv. I've been in the theater. <laughs> uh, if Dr. Diggity Dank was here, I would not be on camera, and that's not because we would be, like, making out or anything, but, um, yeah, Dr. Diggity Dank and I, you know, we're gonna throw, throw a few back and, uh, look at the horizon or something and, uh, making out <laughs> and making out, um, so um let's talk a little bit about our uh, our upcoming I know I need I need to figure out I I don't know what what dad joke is my favorite. Um I will get back to you on that one. I do owe you that. Um so um coming up with programming for the next couple of weeks cuz we're going to do Christmas specials on Monday and Friday from here on out. Um just until, uh, <laughs> just, yeah, <laughs> that's a good one, Doc. Um, but, um, so we're going to do video game Christmas specials on Friday. Um, there are a bunch of really good specials that are on YouTube that we should probably watch. Like the Garfield Christmas specials on YouTube. Um, the Chipmunks Christmas special, the, the Chuck Jones directed one is uh is there i think it's directed by chuck jones um there are a couple of really really good ones but we also gotta um we also gotta dig in the garbage so um i actually looked at a couple of lists and i have a few um a few really bad ones um there's also a couple of Hanna Barbera ones that i want to do but i don't know or i'm going to switch back to this i don't know if i'm going to um We'll put the music back on. I don't know if um, if I'm gonna have like a dedicated Hanna Barbera night, because um, those are a little trickier to find on YouTube. Um, but on the 23rd, um, I don't know if there's gonna be a stream, but I'm working on putting together a dedicated broadcasting machine that is going to just show Christmas specials in the discord um 24 7 until christmas um i think that would be kind of fun so any anything that we watch on stream i'm gonna download it'll be a part of it and then um we'll get some other ones we're not we're not super limited by uh by you know copyright stuff on discord like as far as i know um we can we can show whatever we want to, as long as it doesn't break the law. Um, so, like, uh, Muppet Christmas Carol. Maybe we could find that one on the internet somewhere. Um, you know, the, the classic Rankin-Bass specials. Um, those are, you know, uh, Charlie Brown, stuff like that. If, if we could get that together, um, just have it in the Discord, like, that would be, that would be something fun. Um... And then, the day after Christmas is actually my birthday. So, um, I don't really know what we're gonna do for that yet. Um, I did kind of toy around with the idea of going to a, uh, a roller rink. 
Um, coincidentally, the, uh, it's a roller rink that I, like, in elementary school, um, they would have like, oh, roller skate night, you know, come support your school. And you would go roller skating at this rink. And um, yeah, I, I really kind of want to go roller skating. Um, I was never good at roller skating. I feel like at, uh, I'll be 38 years old. That's, you know, I'm running out of time to try roller skating again. So before, um, you know, I think it's like after like 39 when you fall down like you just explode into a cloud of red gore and, and mist like I think that's when falling down like just general falls will like put your lights out and and end your uh, tenure on the planet earth um, <laughs> so I don't know there are a couple people from high school kind of wanted to go too, or they said they would be available um, hip replacement time. Hey, um, I don't know. Really. I just want to see if, if it smells like it does, did when I was a kid and if they still have the arcade machines, cause I'm pretty sure they had uh, sunset riders. It's a really fun, um, kind of beat em up game with cowboys. Um, I do kind of want to see if they have their arcade machines. Like, God, I will go anywhere for an arcade machine. Um, so we'll see. I don't know if I'm going to do any any kind of stream thing for my birthday. Um, I don't know exactly. I'm not sure yet. Uh, stay tuned for that. Um, I do have a couple of videos in mind that I want to release between now and the end of the year. So that'll happen. She got so much good stuff going on. There's like videos... There's stream stuff like I love watching bad Christmas specials. It's pretty much um, it's, it's pretty much Luke exclusive and uh, nobody in my family would watch the bad Christmas specials because they're bad. Oh, we have, speaking of Christmas specials, not bad ones. We have to watch Mr. Magoo. That one might be on YouTube if that's on YouTube or watching that with Razzleberry dressing that I believe was the first animated Christmas special and uh, it slaps. It's uh, really cool, and I love that art style. Um, if you look at the little Luke Land guy, um, the little head, uh, I I commissioned an artist to kind of mimic the style of the Underdog show. Um, so those those old shows really, really. I mean, they just they make me feel things. Um, so if we can explore some of those, that would be good. And, uh, I am planning on commissioning some more stuff from him, and, uh, honestly, like, I want to learn to animate like that. Um, I don't know. Next year, I would love to animate something. I don't know, we'll talk about New Year's resolutions soon enough, but, um, man, that is something I think about all the time. Um, because, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm not that old, but, um... It's time to time to get really busy with some stuff. And we've made it to 9 o'clock, so Dr. Diggity Dank lets me live another day. Animating is very hard, but, um, you know, replicating that old style might be a little easier, especially with the tools that are out there today. Um, because, you know, I, I don't know. I... I, I kind of mostly animated in tweens with motion tweens but um yeah um, I, I really ah uh, we've got creative stuff going and uh that's thank you to for all of you for that like really the engagement that i have on the internet these little interactions um on stream um man it's just it drives me to create more stuff and i'm very excited to uh go from this right now to editing a video for tomorrow probably um so i will let you guys go for now and uh you know at some point i'm going to take a break but right now this is uh it's very motivating and uh, i appreciate all of you the discord is so much fun um bernie mac is probably the discord mvp just because we always we're always always talking about stuff and uh, i'll talk to you guys later you have a great day. Um, I Eat Socks does frame-by-frame -frame animation. It's so time-consuming. 
Yeah, I get. I, I totally get that. We'll talk more about animation soon. And I do think that um, in the future, one of our weekly streams is going to be watching um, watching something bad. Okay, we're going to watch something bad together. Like, we're going to watch A Troll in Central Park. We're going to watch Felix the Cat, the movie. Um, we're going to watch The Thief and the Cobbler. Like, that's going to be part of our uh, our weekly routine. There's going to be a movie night. So, keep that in your, in your brain. Uh, we'll revisit that a little later. There'll be some gaming. There'll be some watching. But from here on out, on the stream side of things, it is all Christmas crap. So, I will see you on Friday for Christmas Comes to Pac-Land. We have a Sonic the Hedgehog Christmas special. We have... Um... Gosh, I know we have more... We have the Mario Christmas special, Koopa Claus, and then there's even one more that I can't remember. Okay, that, that's all on the internet though. We'll uh, we'll uh, we'll do that. All right, take care everybody. Have a good everything. You know, day, night, whatever you got. Enjoy it, and I will see you soon. Thank you so much. Bye.